Hello my dear friends and my dear students. Today we are taking another new topic how to represent a complex number. You have got how to represent a point in a Cartesian plane. Here you have drawn a line like this, another line this, line like this. They are perpendicular to each other. This is called x axis and this is called y axis. But in cut if we want to represent a complex number this x axis is termed as a real axis and we do not say this vertical axis as y axis this is called the imaginary axis this concept was first given by jean robert argan that's why this plane is also known as argan plane or complex plane all right this is his picture you can see now here suppose you have to represent a complex number 3 plus 2i okay this is the number 3 plus 2i so how will plot from the origin in the first quadrant you move this 3 unit then above it 2 unit in this way we can represent 3 comma 2 okay so now to solve the questions of exercise 3.3 the first question question number one let us move here in question number one we have to plot the points in the argon plane okay and the first question what we have got is 3 minus 2i so this 3 minus 2i can be written as 3 plus within bracket minus 2 into i as you can see now so the point we have to plot is 3 comma minus 2 so from the origin let us take 3 distance 3 unit let us move 3 distance okay then it is minus 2 so we have to go below it so here we will locate the point 3 comma minus 2 we shall represent we have obtained the point where we locate it yes this is the point 3 comma minus 2 thus this complex number is represented next question is 1 minus 2i into 2i plus 5 let us multiply 1 into 2i is 2i plus 5 minus 4i square minus 10i now let us simplify it is 2i plus 5 then it is 4 then minus 10i let us add this now let us start adding 5 plus 4 is 9 and this is minus 8i so the point which we have to locate is 9 comma minus 8 so from the origin let us take 9 unit yes 9 unit we have taken and minus 8 we have to go below it so this 8 minus 8 we have taken we have taken here so the point will be 9 comma minus 8 let us plot this point here let us mark it is 9 comma minus 8 okay now number c is minus 7i only now here minus 7i can be represented as 0 plus within bracket minus 7i okay the real part is 0 so from the origin the as the real part is 0 we have to move only minus 7 below in the downward direction to represent only minus 7 thus we have represented here let us mark the point okay the point is marked its coordinate is 0 comma minus 7 then number d is only 8 it is only real part and the imaginary part will be 0 a so you can write 8 plus 0 into i so how will you locate this point from the origin from 0 let us move only 8 distance 8 unit and it is neither move up or down so there only it will be located its coordinate is 8 comma 0 next comes number e it is 5 minus 4i so in the real axis we have to move 5 unit then in the imaginary axis in from the below it is 4 there we have located so let us mark the point here it will be let us mark it first it is 5 comma minus 4 
then the last is number f it is z it is the conjugate of we have to take the conjugate of 4 minus 3i okay so what is the conjugate of it 4 plus 3i okay now 4 from the origin let us take 4 unit let us take 4 then 3i upward direction yes we have obtained the position let us mark there so it will be here let us at first mark coordinate is 4 comma 3 thus we have plotted all the points dear students now we are about to start question number two before starting this solution we have to know one term what is modulus of a complex number now let us consider two perpendicular lines or the axis this is the real axis and this is the imaginary axis and this is called the argon plane this is xo x dash and this imaginary axis is represented by y o y dash okay now there is a point p okay suppose its coordinate or position is given by x y there this imaginary or the complex number is given by x plus i y so its point is x y now the origin the coordinates of the origin is 0 0 coordinates of this point is x y what is this distance okay this distance is known as the modulus modulus of this complex number z that means what is this op op how will find that is in coordinate geometry we learn the distance formula square root of x minus 0 whole square plus then y minus 0 whole square that means x square plus y square okay so we learn that if any complex number is there in the form x plus i y or a plus i b then its modulus or the modulus means the magnitude is given by square root of x square plus y square that is square of the real part plus square of the imaginary part okay now let us proceed to solve question number two amare the first question to us say the complex number z is given by 4 minus 3i okay amar ki ulao lage we have to find the modulus the modulus can go ulao square root of the real part square of the real part plus it can go like minus 3 whole square so it will be 4 square will be 16 minus 3 square 9 square root of 16 plus 9 25 is equal to 5 and I will call it ok that is the number b to yet kuru z as the complex number is z which is equal to minus 6 plus 8i so, the modulus to can occur allow me I mean modulus come short of get a cut a mod will you ami go a mod mod minus 6 square plus 8 square is it okay minus 6 square kiman ho 36 and 8 square is 64 their sum is kiman ho 100 and the square root of 100 is 10 is it okay number C to Korean. Now, dear students, we will take the number C. Okay, here in question number two, the this complex number we have taken C equal to is this complex number is given by say Z Z equal to 3 plus 4i into 5 plus 12i. It will be Korean. I mean, I know that modulus yet the marquee will always say modulus will always say okay. So, I know that the Z1 Z2 you know, the product of modulus will always say. What formula we use? Modulus of Z1 into modulus of Z2. This formula we use here also. As we are asked to find the modulus, so let us find like this 3 plus 4i into 5 plus 12i. It will modulus along. So, a dutta product will be separate kuru for modulus 2. Then, a modulus separate kuru 3 plus 4i at a modulus, that we shall air modulus 5 plus. 12i okay it is modulus ami keno bolao ami janu jodi eta complex number enoka thake x plus i y so what is the modulus of it square root of x square plus y square then ya to enoka kori square root of etu 3 square hobo plus here 4 square and etur 
5 square plus 12 square okay so as it are product as here 3 square 9 4 square given 16 correct here. to multiply 5 square 25 are 12 square 144 so a dot add kuru kiman pump 25 pump a add kuru kiman pump 169 pump the square root of 25 5 hobo r way to square root of 169 is how much 13 so 13 5 ja 65 in this way we have found the modulus of this complex number okay now dear students we have taken this complex number that is number d amar eta formula as a jodi modulus of z1 by z2 thake to ami dota anaka separate kori o paru a to sum of into two and a curio paru in the me just simplify curry curry to eti just formula nisana may apply curu the atama modulus ulavo quise to year modulus and ulavo paru this is very simple sum aru yaro modulus ulavo paru take a set like a year modulus to canaka hobo three square hobo aru a to four square hobo tarpish of year kiman hobo a to five square R to 12 square. Got it? Okay. Tar I am to simplify it. Main part I am Just what we have to do, we have to simplify. So, 3 square 9, 4 square 16, 5 square 25, 12 square 144. So, square root of 9 plus 16, this is 25. This is 144 to 169. So, square root of 25. 5 hobo are to 1 square root of 169 and 13. So, in this way we have found now it is number E. Query mami okay. Tarpesh ami ya number E to lolu. It will make a suppose to malaka janai a to the power minus n ami canaka liku 1 by a to the power n. Then I get to liku 1 by 1 minus i whole square are to sorry minus a sil minus 2 my bullet to the anai 1 plus i whole square. Is it okay? Just simplify it to okay. A minus B whole square formula a square minus twice AB plus B square whole. That we should plus a say that we should yet one to say it to A plus B whole square. Deca a square plus twice AB plus B square. Okay, again easy. Just we have expanded it using the formula of here a minus B whole square. Are we at a plus B whole square? Use okay. 1 square 1 minus 2i or i square minus 1. Sum to both easy way as a sub. Plus 1. This is 1. 2 into i hobo i square minus 1. So, yet keep us to two whole. 1 1 cancel whole. 1 1 cancel whole. So, ultimately, a number to keep one hobo minus 1 by twice i hobo. Or we to keep hobo 1 by twice i. You see, they are equal but opposite. So, they will cancel each other. So, to can go zero. Zero took the A plus B IB format liquid visaru. Real part plus imaginary part. Our question to Kia what we have to find? We had to find what is the modulus of it. Modulus is an okay. Zero square plus zero square. So it is zero level. Okay. Tarpish Aru Ketaman question as I mean question to liquid. Okay. Tarpish the mean number F to Lulu. Okay. It ran a formata sako. It month as it will occur. Z1 by Z2 and okay, Jadit are more to low. So, and okay, we can separate. Okay, it will yet barbar. I mean, use how okay, the Jadi it will use how for it to me separate for you. Paru they into us. Okay, we shall use this. So, it will amount modulus. Love of we said, I mean, it will modulus. Ulam correct. So, here modulus to one. Hobo are it will give one. Hobo. 1 square or i money key i money i into 1 a 1 to yet like issue okay so to keep on here 1 square root of 1 square 1 or a 1 square 1 to 1 by root 2 okay that pressure i mean g curry i mean i think the g like you it to modulus will all again to me separate curry them and okay because we know the formula. What is the formula again? I am repeating z1 by z2. So, here go to it to modulus. So, go to it to modulus. So, I am separate. Can I separate? So, 
जेड ओन और जेड टू एने सेपरेट कर मडुलास के आम आक रिपीट करफ जेड इज इक्ल टू एक्स प्लास आई वाई व्हाट इज द मडुलास अफ जेड स्कोर रुट अफ एक्स स्कोर प्लास वाई स्कोर तुम लोग किसान कन्फ्यूज हो जा पड़े व्हाट इज वन माइनास आई वन माइनास आई एने वन प्लास माइनास वन इंटू आई ठीक है तो तार एने पार स्कोर रुट अफ वन स्कोर प्लास ए माइनास वन स्कोर टू यार के मडुलास लो पार वन स्कोर प्लास इतना तो प्लास वन आसे वन प्लास आई मानी ए प्लास आई वि फर्म ए प्लास आई वि तो ये वन स्कोर वन स्कोर वन माइनास वन स्कोर वन 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 तो रुट टू रुट टू इज इक्ल टू वन ओके तार पास जी हो गल एज आम देखा इन नम्बर एज द कम्प्लेक्स नम्बर इज दिस सो लेटास एप्लाई द फर्मुला कि फर्मुला आको मैं इतना लिखी दीसूँ जेड ओन जेड टू जो मड थे प्रडक्टर आई मिन उन्न सेपरेट जो डिड थे एगेन उ कैन सेपरेट सो हेयर व्हाट उ टू फाइंड उ टू फाइंड देयर मडुलस तो वन प्लास आई इंटू टू प्लास आई तर मडुलस और इार मडुलस हम थ्री प्लास आई आम डायरेक्ट सेपरेट कर दीसूँ ओके तो इो सेपरेट हम जो इंटू टू थे इतना सेपरेट कर सो लेटास मेक दम सेपरेट वन प्लास आई इंटू टू प्लास आई ओके तार पास थ्री प्लास आई ओके ये आम इंडिविजुअल मडुलस कट ऊँ और सीम्प्लीफाई करूँ इार कि हम वन स्कोर हम और इार कि हम वन स्कोर तार पास इत टू स्कोर प्लास वन स्कोर ओके तुम लोग वन टू के बुझी पासा एक्सप्लेन कर सपोज यू आज जैसे वन प्लास आई मानी वन प्लास आई इंटू वन ए प्लास आई वि फर्म आसे ओके ए टू स्कोर और ए टू स्कोर लैस इत थ्री स्कोर और आई थे ए टू स्कोर हो जा दिस इज दिस टांस टू वन दिस इज वन इंटू आज मजद Nothing is there means into two square is four. This is one. This is nine plus one. So this is root two into root five into root ten. If we simplify further, this is five obviously. Root ten by root ten is equal to how much? One. So in this way we have solved h. Now what is left? This is left. Now let us do this sum. Now in the last question. Here we have to find the modulus. Okay, so attack attack separate kori. One minus i. Ya to direct kori si walok. Itya to malo ke bujhi sahi kano ka kori bolake. Kote ek attack ani separate kori disu. Modulus modulus modulus. Okay, ek ek formula use kori. Jitte into tha ke separate kori si. Jitte divide tha ke ano ka separate kori si. So kano ke bolavo paru. Itu one minus i mane ako ki. One plus i into minus 1 to so, 1 square aru minus 1 square hoigol tar pishot e2 1 square plus e2 ki manabo minus 2 square buji paisa tar pishot yat 1 ako e2 jodi tomaloka karo doubt ho 1 minus 3i mane ki 1 plus i into minus 3 to ei karone e2 ro square aru e2 ro square under the square root 1 square plus माइनास थ्री स्कोर नाउ जस्ट लेट आस सीम्प्लीफाई इट ओके लेट आस सीम्प्लीफाई नाउ वन स्कोर वन वन स्कोर वन ए वन स्कोर वन माइनास टू स्कोर कि हम फोर हम ए टू वन स्कोर वन एंड माइनास थ्री स्कोर इज हम नाइन ठीक है ये अलमोस्ट एक सामी तो हो गल टू फाइव रुट टेन तो टेन देखा सेम बस्तु ऊल रुट टेन इज इक्ल टू वन ओके ना लेट मोक टू क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री ना डे स्टूडेंट्स इन क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री 
the question is by using argon plan show that the points which represent the number 3 plus 4i minus 3 plus 4i minus 3 minus 4i and 3 minus 4i are concyclic means they lie in a circle again we have to find the radius of the circle here the first point we have to choose is 3 plus 4i okay let us choose this point 3 plus 4i okay where it will lie from the origin let us take plus 3 distance on the real axis we have taken then we have to move 4 distance upward 4 unit upward let us take okay so we have obtained the position let us mark this point here so you can see we are marking the points okay this point is marked its coordinates we can write 3 comma 4 that means it is the representation of 3 plus 4i next point is minus 3 plus 4i from the origin we shall move minus 3 in the negative direction of x axis let us take the point from the origin let us move minus 3 ok we have moved then it is 4i that means we will move upward ok let us take a distance there ok so we have got the position let us remove this length so let us mark the point as we have obtained the position it is minus 3 comma 4 thus we have obtained the position of the second complex number next complex number is minus 3 minus 4 i ok from the origin let us take 3 unit in the negative direction ok 3 unit we have taken then we have to represent minus 4 i in the negative direction ok that means in the below part of it we have got the point so let us mark there it will be at first let us mark here yes this is the point it is minus 3 comma minus 4 thus we have obtained and the next point is 3 minus 4 i so from the origin let us take 3 unit in the positive x direction or the positive real axis then minus 4 i that means we have to move below it so 4 unit let us move ok there let us mark the point here let us mark the point it is what will be the position 3 comma minus 4 now we have to show that these four points lie in a circle or not so let us take a circle and we try to pass through all the th four points ok then will be the points will be concyclic ok let us try to pass this circle through all the points let us try let us stretch it so that they passes the circle passes through these points is it appears that the circle will pass through all the four points okay yes the circle really passes through the four points okay so the first part is done that is we have to prove that they are concyclic we have proved next we are asked to find what is the or find the radius of the circle radius we can easily find okay so everybody can say that radius is 5 unit because from the origin to this on the real axis it is 5 unit or from the origin to this it is 5 unit but let us mark from origin to this 3 to 4 distance okay so this is 5 unit here I am showing that all the distance are equal okay now let us find it mathematically that really it is 5 unit let us mark that point BP and the origin is O let us find the length radius that is OP how will find OP let us write OP will be equal to square root of x square let us write this OP equal to x square plus y square ok now what is the value of x x is 3 so it will be 3 square plus 4 square now 3 square is how much let us write 3 square is 9 and 4 square is 16 their sum is 25 the so square root of 25 is 5 so radius is 5 unit ok 
hello students now we have taken question number 4a here the question is show that the points represented by the complex number minus 2 plus 3i minus 6 plus i and minus 10 minus i are collinear we have taken the argon plane you can see now we want to show that the first point minus 2 plus 3i on the argon plane now here minus 2 plus 3i how can we represent it is minus 2 comma this imaginary part is 3 or complex imaginary part is 3 so this minus 2 comma 3 we want to plot from the origin we will move 2 unit in the left side we have moved then it is in the imaginary axis we have to move 3 unit upward ok let us move 3 unit so here we have obtained the point obtained the position so let us mark here the position is minus 2 comma 3 let us circle it yes minus 2 comma 3 in this way we have represented minus 2 plus 3i next point next complex number is minus 6 plus i so this can be written as minus 6 plus i into 1 so here this coordinate can be written as minus 6 comma 1 because this is in the form of a plus ib so now minus 6 how will represent from the origin we will move 6 unit on the left side you can see then it is 1 in the imaginary axis so we have moved upward let us locate the point let us make a dot here let us circle it ok it is minus 6 comma 1 thus we have represented minus 6 plus i next we want to represent minus 10 minus i so this complex number can be written as minus 10 plus within bracket minus 1 into i so as a coordinate we can write minus 10 comma minus 1 so now how will represent from the origin we will move 10 unit in the left direction ok then minus 1 that means in the imaginary axis we have to move 1 unit in the downward direction below it ok so let us move yes we have obtained the position now let us make a dot there and we make a small circle coordinate we can write minus 10 comma minus 1 now here the question is we have to show that they are collinear how can we show them that they are collinear we have to draw a line now let us draw a line so that the, this line passes through all the points the line we can see the line passes through all the three points and we give arrow sign on both the direction it means that we can produce this in both either direction hence we have proved that the these three complex number are collinear as they lie in the same straight line now dear students we have taken question number 4b question is so that the line joining the points represented by 1 plus 3i and minus 2 minus 6i passes through the origin so here we have taken the argon plane okay here let us take the first complex number 1 plus 3i now how can we represent this 1 plus 3i now how know you know how to represent it it is within as a coordinate we can write 1 comma 3 okay now how will represent this 1 comma 3 on this arcane plane from the origin on the positive direction that is on the right side let us take one unit okay then we will move upward 3 unit okay we move upward 3 unit now let us remove these two lines then let us locate the point okay let us mark here the coordinate is 1 comma 3 okay then next point is minus 2 minus 6 i so as a coordinate we can write minus 2 comma minus 6 okay now we want to locate this minus 2 comma minus 6 from the origin we will move two unit on the left side then we want to move this minus 6 in the imaginary axis that is below it we have to move 
thus we have drawn a line in this line so that you can understand let us remove these two lines and now let us locate the point here we have encircled it let us write the coordinate minus 2 comma minus 6 now question is we have to show that these two complex number passes through the origin so for this let us draw a line and if this line passes through the origin then we can show that these two complex number passes through the origin yes we can see that they these two line sorry this line joining the two points passes through the origin in this way we have proved that these two complex number passes through the origin here we have taken question number 4c question is by using argon diagram show that the points represented by the complex number minus 2 plus 3i 5 plus 8i and minus 9 minus 2i are collinear okay collinear means they lie in the same straight line we have taken the first complex number it is minus 2 plus 3i now how you represent you know it how to represent can you call minus 2 comma 3 long take a say minus 2 comma 3 or it is it can both represent could 0 for a will move minus 2 that is left to pin a minus 2 that is the upper 3 jump 3 unit jump I made a line draw coro then let us remove these two line because we have located the position I will go buji paisa point to go to go here they have coordinate we can write as minus 2 comma 3 that person next complex number which is 5 plus 8 I can occur present query me to me attract them is yes a it will mean a girl like him 5 comma 8 take us a it will be kind of a represent cream pipe come out original for a original for a I mean right of 5 unit jump that we should 8 to imaginary access at 8 upper of our 8 unit level you we have marked there 8 at a line draw coro so that you can understand at a 8 unit draw curry mommy here for a 8 unit the point to location code you go for a city a little line remove coro yeah the meter at the mark coro human 5 comma 8 it will be cool to 5 comma 8 that we should next complex number is a minus 9 comma sorry minus 9 minus 2 I it will be kind of a represent curry paru minus 9 comma minus 2 the me real axis of the tia minus 9 money from the origin will move 9 unit in the left direction I mean John original for a minus 9 that is the minus 2 as imaginary axis of money to lot of him the meter point to locate could you buy look the Tata media mark guru minus 9 comma minus 2 okay mark will it's a question to kia sile question is that we have to show that they are collinear so we have to draw a line so that the line passes through all the three points i mean first of the point join query sound okay join code it is a point to put a third point to join code they should lie in the same straight line take us at all over the key of parisa i mean at a line draw query so and we'll find that we'll find that the three points line the same straight line to zoom out pretty much they come to my local club do you know look what I do I wrote a okay zoom it was our party said a the line the same straight line okay I'm at a arrow sign did on the pin a so that it appears that this line can be produced on either direction so in this way we have proved that these points are collinear because they lie in the same straight line so I'm looking for Jesus again okay now my beloved student we have taken question number five question to hold if z is equal to x plus i y and this is given then prove that y equal to zero I mean here plus start curve what is given modulus of z minus 5 y z plus 5 y equal to 1 I mean first of key formula you could be doing asylum I mean you know modulus of n okay you take a jet one by jet two I mean it was separate could you borrow this formula we have okay so here also let us make them separate modulus of z minus 5y 
divided by modulus of z plus phi y is equal to 1. Now here you can see we have separated using that formula. Okay, here cross multiply kuru, cross multiply kule cannot be over z plus phi y is equal to 1 into this z plus phi y full. Correct? Ethia z to substitute kurim, z equal to x plus i y, x plus i y, arukia se minus phi y. Here also x, z is equal to x plus i y plus 5 i. Okay, it is a real part, a real, real part at i as a x as a here put me i common by long y minus 5. So this is in this form a plus i b. It will same kuru x plus here let us take i common y plus 5. Okay, now here you see here we are finding the modulus. How do we find modulus at a complex number as a x plus i y? How do we find its modulus? And you call square root of x square plus y square. It will be continuous u square also. So here also let us find the modulus. It is modulus symbol. So modulus along x square r x square plus y square. Here y is y minus 5 whole square hobo. This is whole square. This is x square plus here y plus 5 whole square. Okay, now what we do? Let us square both the side. If we square both the side, what will happen? This square root will be removed. So, let us just remove the square root. What is the procedure? We are squaring both the sides. X square plus, we will get like this. In the bracket, you may write here, squaring both the sides. Tar pishat ki koru, ami yad expand korim. Okay? It will expand korim. A to a kya se x square plus here a a minus b also that is y minus 5 whole square so it is a square minus twice b plus b square so we shall write y square minus twice y into b plus b square this is done then again this equal to x square equal to x square then plus y plus 5 whole square y plus 5 whole square so a square plus twice y into 5 plus 5 square okay now you see if we simplify it further what will we get x square plus this is y square minus 10 y plus this is 25 is equal to this is x square y square 2 5 are 10 y plus 25 now you can see here this x square x square we can remove from both the sides because if we bring this side they will get cancelled y square y square we can remove from both the sides 25 25 will get cancelled if we bring this 25 25 25 cancel hoja bo to ultimately ki thakile minus 10 y aru ap ne ki thakile 10 y okay tar pishot minus 10 y buji se etia kena kori bolo get is equal to 0 so it is minus 20 y is equal to 0 so y 0 divided by minus 20 ki man hobo 0 etu amar proof kori bo lagi sile okay question was Prove this y equal to 0. Have you understood? Now, dear students, we took question number 6a. If z is equal to x plus i y and this is given, we are asked to show that x square plus y square is equal to 1. I mean, core plus start. I mean, given here plus start. Okay, what is given? Modulus of twice z plus 1 is equal to modulus of z plus 2. You will find this sum is also very easy. What we will do here, we shall substitute what is z given z is x plus i y. So 2 into z x plus i y is it okay plus 1 modulus. We have modulus modulus of z z value to x plus i y plus 2. We have modulus of z plus 2 so plus 2. I mean take it the real part or imaginary part separate korim. And for this, what we have to do? We have to multiply here twice x plus twice i y plus 1 x plus i y plus 2 yeah that is yeah, real part the two questions real part and imaginary part will make them separate how will separate you see here yeah, real part ki yeah, say twice x as aru 1 so let us write them together twice x plus 1 aru imaginary part and okay and this is x plus 2 yeah that is this is real part. This are this. Are we at i y? So, etia. I mean, if 
जेड इज इक्वल टू एक्स प्लस एक्टर कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर एन का से व्हाट इज द मॉडुलस स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर सेम थिंग लेट अस अप्लाई हियर स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर इटू एक्स इटू वाई अमर कारण है वाई स्क्वेयर इज इट ओके तार पर हियर आल्सो लेट अस अप्लाई द सेम थिंग एक्स स्क्वेयर प्लस वाई स्क्वेयर बिकॉज़ वी आर फाइंडिंग द मॉडुलस x plus 2 whole square or this is y square got it now what we'll do usual procedure we will, the problem is with the square root what we'll do how we'll remove the square root we will square both the sides so let us square both the sides so if we square both the side this square root will be removed twice x plus 1 whole square plus twice y whole square is equal to x plus 2 whole square plus y square okay now in the bracket you may write squaring both the sides okay now let us expand if this is of the form a plus b whole square here also this is of the form a plus b whole square so you know the formula a square plus twice a b plus b square so this is 4 y square again here a plus b whole square a square plus twice a b plus b square plus this is y square so let us simplify it further this is 4x square 2 to the 4x 1 square 1 this is 4y square is equal to again let us simplify it this is x square plus this is 4x plus 4 plus y square now let us see what can we do can we simplify or cancel anything okay what we do Question is, we, we are asked to find x square plus y square is equal to 1. So, all term containing x and y, let us bring in this side and numbers on the other side. So, it ki hobo dekha. 4x square, actually we can cancel 4x, 4x, later we will find. 4x square plus this 4x plus this 4y square. A to 1 to pass the epinologism. Is sorry, equal to no hobo. This is plus x square in this side it is minus x square this is minus 4x this is minus y square and in this side it is 4 and this plus 1 on the other side it will be minus 1 okay so remaining part of me this is 4x square this 4x square and minus x square what is the difference 3x square then this 4x 4x will get cancelled 4y square minus y square plus 3y square is equal to 4 minus 1 3 you see the sum is too easy now 3 we'll, we can take common x square plus y square is equal to 3 so x square plus y square 3 as a 3 to into as a pingole divide by jabo. all right so thus we have got x square plus y square is equal to 1 in this way we could prove now let us move to the 6b here you will find that this 6b is almost similar to 6a here again just like the previous sum let us start from here what is given modulus of w plus 6 is equal to modulus of twice w plus 3 now let us substitute what is w w is a plus ib so a plus ib plus this 6 is equal to modulus of 2w what is w here a plus ib a plus ib plus 3 okay this is given now let us separate the real part a is ro6 real part so let us make them right together this is ib okay this is twice a plus if we multiply it will be twice ib plus 3 okay so here a plus 6 plus ib here also let us write the real parts together and the imaginary parts separate we'll write twice a plus 3 plus i into twice b in this way you will write so what is the modulus again i repeat the same thing complex number z given by x plus i y what is the modulus square root of x square plus y square if i repeat it obviously you will be 
very fast in doing this square root x square plus y square real part square plus imaginary part square a plus 6 whole square plus b square real part square real part square imaginary part square now you know it the procedure we have to remove the square root how will remove the square root by squaring both the side so let us do that a plus 6 whole square plus b square this is twice a plus 3 whole square twice b square got it so we have squared both the side now let us just expand just like the previous sum a plus b whole square a square plus twice a b plus b square okay this is done this is expanded now this is b square written now this is again we shall expand a plus b whole square a square plus twice a b plus b square you see we have expanded a plus b whole square this is a square plus twice a b plus b square then this is twice b square so it is 4b square let us simplify it further a square so 2 6 are 12 a this is 36 this is b square 2 a whole square 4 a square 2 2 are 4 4 3 are 12 plus 9 3 square 9 plus 4 b square again same thing as we are asked to prove a square plus b square equal to 9 so the term containing all a and b will bring on the left hand side numbers on the other side so let us do that this a square plus this 12 here also 12 by 12 will get cancelled you will see 12 a plus b square okay this is not written here this part we shall write on the other hand this is minus 4 a square if we bring here then this is minus 12 a this is minus 4 b square is equal to what is left here this 9 is left and here we have to bring this plus 36 on the other side will be minus 36 now let us simplify it here so let us give you implied sign here now this a square and minus 4 a square what is the sum minus 3 a square correct then plus 12 a minus 12 a will get cancelled after this plus b square minus 4 b square how much minus 3 b square here 9 minus 36 all of you are now 80 minus 27 so what we'll do minus 3 is common a square plus b square is equal to minus 27 you see i said the sum is too easy for us minus 27 divided by minus 3 so thus what we'll write now a square plus b square is equal to 9 thus we have proved all right